بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از اسد یعقوب اینڈ آئی ایم فرام لاہور پاکستان اینڈ آئی ٹیچ آئی ایل سیا ویل گائز ونس اگین آئی ویلکم یو ٹو مائی جنرل ٹریننگ آئی ایلس رائٹنگ ٹاسک ون اسپیسمین فار سیون بینڈ بیسکلی اٹ از اے سیون بینڈ ایس اے وچ آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو شو یو رائٹ ناؤ آئی نو جنرل ٹریننگ گائز دے آلویز نیڈ ایٹ سیون 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 دیٹس وٹ دے کال میجک بین اسکور اوکے دے آر آلویز لوکنگ فار ایٹ ٹریپل سیون اینڈ اٹس ریئلی آئی مین دے آر گیٹنگ ایٹ دے آر گیٹنگ ٹو سیونس بٹ ان ان رائٹنگ دے آر آلویز گیٹنگ سکس سکس پوائنٹ فائیو سکس سکس پوائنٹ فائیو اینڈ دے ڈونٹ نو ہاؤ ٹو کوپ اپ ود رائٹنگ سو گائز دس لیٹر از اے گڈ اسپیسمین فار سیون بینڈ اینڈ دس از دس ایس دس لیٹر از ایوارڈیڈ سیون بینڈ بائی کیمبرج ایگزامینرز سو اٹس ناٹ دیٹ دس مٹیریل از ناٹ اتھینٹیکیٹیڈ دس از کوائٹ اتھینٹیکیٹیڈ مٹیریل آئی ہیو گاٹ اٹ فرام کیمبرج آئلس بک نمبر فورٹین ول گائز لیٹس جسٹ سی دا ٹاپک از رائٹنگ ٹاسک ون یو شوڈ اسپینڈ اباؤٹ ٹوینٹی منٹس آن دس ٹاسک یو ہیو سین این ایڈورٹیزمنٹ ان این آسٹریلین میگزین فار سم ون to live with a family for six months and look after their six-year-old child. Okay, write a letter to the parents. In your letter, explain why you would like the job. Give details of why you would be a suitable person to employ. Say how you would spend your free time while you are in Australia. So write at least 150 words. Do not need to write any addresses. begin your letter as follows dear sir or madam and then comma now let's see band seven answer it says this is an answer written by a candidate who achieved a seven band score dear mr and mrs collins so instead of writing dear sir or madam this candidate has written dear mr and mrs collins my name is uh, carola I have seen your advertisement in a magazine and I'm writing to you because I would like to be considered for the position you are offering. Now, by the way, it's a formal letter and I see a contraction here. Otherwise, they always teach us not to use the contractions. Anyways, uh, let's go on. I really would like to work for you because I think it will be a good experience for you and me. All right. I like to travel, comma, know about different cultures and meet new people. I have never been to Australia, but I am pretty sure there uh, I'm pretty sure there a lot of thing to see and try. There is some problem with this sentence by the way. I have previous experience looking after children. Currently, I'm working for an Irish family and I take care of four children. So check the spelling of four. <laughs> I take care of four children and still they gave them seven band and a CS to kinna vadiya lekhne a mar jane sanu seven ni dende thornu mein dasa ha. All right. Uh, I have previous experience looking after children. Uh, currently I'm working for an Irish family and I take care of four children that's the mistake whose ages vary from three to eight all right again there's something wrong here I have to say that I have never thought that looking after children would be that rewarding I enjoy spending time with them and I have learned a lot I'm really patient tidy reliable and hard working okay all right i'm doubtful about this comma as well there's no need for that reliable and comma in addition i have just completed an first aid course mar jane ho inna nu kidda seven deta thodi aisi di taisi in addition i have just completed an first aid it should be a first aid because f is not a vowel and see this sentence does not belong to any paragraph If I had the chance to live with you would be great if I had the chance to live with you would be great this sentence is incorrect as well I would spend my free time learning English visiting uh, tourist attractions check the spelling of tourist huh oh, I don't know 
why they've given seven band and we write very good essays and they don't give us good band score. We write very good letters. Visiting tourist attractions, trying local food and making new friends. Thank you for taking the time to read my letter. Please feel free to contact me if you need further details and recommendations. Kind regards, comma, Carola. Carola, teri te mojjaan lag gaya, seven band mil gaya, huh? So anyways, let's see now. Examiner's comment. The answer presents a clear purpose with a consistent appropriate tone. Okay, each bullet point is clearly highlighted and covered although there is room for some extension means the ideas can be extended information and ideas are logically organized and cohesive devices are used appropriately the range of vocabulary is sufficient to show some flexibility and precision as well as use of collocations the position you are offering that is collocation previous experience rewarding taking the time to read my letter contact me for the details there are only occasional spelling errors like first aids to rest recommendations and there is a range of complex grammatical structure with frequent error free sentences jehdiya mistakes ne ha lagda hindi safarish karai kise ne anyways this has said this letter got seven band so guys what i understand from here i mean they don't lie basically what we do we write in an overly complicated manner number 1 number 2 we use english which is the translated version of urdu hindi punjabi right so we don't use collocations for you i would like to advise you do not use complicated vocabulary words in your letters and your essays number 1 number 2 uh, write very clearly and do not write your translated sentences try to learn collocations and try to use collocations because collocations can give you seven band and even eight band and collocation is one of the thing which non native speakers do not use because they tend to translate from their mother tongue to Uh, this english language that's why they do not they cannot actually make collocations so i would advise you to learn thousands of collocations and just because of that you will be able to get good band score see this letter got seven band and i'm sure you can write better letters what we do we use difficult words we use complex words right and then we make complex sentences without using proper collocations so we don't get good band score thank you very much if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe my channel i have a facebook page asad yakub ielts you must like my facebook page as well i also teach ielts online if you want to join my online ielts classes my whatsapp number is given you can contact me for that asad yakub wishes you all the best with your ielts preparation take good care of yourselves allah hafiz